Hello, my dear friends. Now, this my video is devoted to education and different cultures in Ukraine. Yes, education, because now I am in a national pedagogical university named after Mikhailo Dragomanov. Yes, this culture is here near the university. He was a very famous pedagogical person, expert in teaching. He was a great teacher. Yes, that's why in his birthday this wonderful sculpture, this monument, has been elected here near the university. And to be a student of National Pedagogical University, named after Dragomanov, is pretty prestigious. Yes, because it's a university in the city, Kiev, capital of Ukraine. It's not easy to enter, you need to pass special examination or tests now in Ukraine. And after that, you can select your university. Only, of course, maybe only 10% of students they can receive stipendium or some money for, for their living. Because most of students were receiving education, just paying for education, which is not really cheap already now in Ukraine. It's not like the former Soviet Union. Now it's much more expensive from maybe 10, 12,000 grivna till maybe about 20,000 grivna or 20, okay, 2,000 euro per one year. Every semester students should pay. And of course, what's about students? Yes, how do they receive the job after university? In the Soviet Union, students, they try to be at least uh, experts in their specialty, but now maybe 80% of students were receiving another job rather than their specialty. They are not going to school, they receive their job somewhere else. And of course, because the salary here in Ukraine pretty poor, just to about maybe 150 to 100 dollars per month. It's quite a poor salary, so that's why if they want to receive better salary, we should enter some commercial companies to work there. Or at least they are young and they receive their support from their parents and grandparents. Most of them they do and they live like that because their parents and relatives were supporting them. And, but uh, nevertheless, some of them who has ambitions, so they can be ambitious people. They can enter another university. There are different programs, fortunately, now to visit uh, uh, different universities worldwide. And after that, people can receive a job or just at least uh, make a better education for their curriculum vitae. They can apply for jobs somewhere abroad, at least probably 80% or maybe 90% of Ukrainian students who would like to work somewhere abroad. They do not speak English, all of them, pretty well, but nevertheless they want to work abroad because it's a better salary and it's a better style of life and it's better pension even after 20 or 30 years after working somewhere abroad. So, if you want to receive education, welcome to Ukraine. It's still relatively cheaper than in other countries. It's a good education. And of course, if you are a student, think about yourself. You can receive education in a prestigious university in Kiev, and then you can go somewhere abroad and live abroad, enjoy life, and receive better education somewhere else. And good luck and best greetings from Kiev, the capital of Ukraine.